Hey guys, I know I'm doing a bit of a late video, but I'm gonna show you my thoughts and opinions on Papa 2018 dinosaurs. I believe this is all the ones they are releasing. It's true, sadly. I believe it is. So, without further ado, it's like uh, almost 11 o'clock. Let's get into it. First off, we have the juvenile Spinosaurus. Now, I don't have anything against this figure. I actually really like it. The head looks quite nice. And it just a replica of its adult counterpart. It's, it's it also came in a box set this year. Um I wish uh, this one is in either I will or I won't get it model. But most likely no. But it's just a little nice model, not too much to say about it, but you can tell it's a juvenile. Next we have the Amargosaurus. My god, this couldn't be any more worse. Safari have made a fantastic one, and Papo disappointed me. Like, there seems to be a lack of scales on this model. All it is is just skin and some wrinkles through the bodies. The colour scheme makes me want to throw up. Honestly, I get that from colour schemes sometimes. And the head. And the back of the thing, I don't know what that's called, but they're not meant to be connected. They're meant to be apart, like the safari one. And the head looks so derpy. And it's super small, it's kind of pointless getting. Next we have Papo Man. Now, for me, I'm not getting this. I, it's just kind of weird. Um, I know it's like a normal man, like a prehistoric man, but it's kind of weird to me. I don't know why they would release that on their dinosaur line. I, I, I don't know why. I just I don't like it. Not much, too much to say about it. Just I hate that. As you can see here, it's a comparison. The older one, the new one. It's kind of cool. All those dust marks. Next, we have the one I'm dreading. Now, I would have most probably liked this if it was in a different pose. If the claws were more stretched out and the neck wasn't so hunched back. But as an articulated jaw, that's interesting. But if it, those arms were out further and its neck wasn't hunched back, I would like this model. Because the detail on the skin actually looks very nice. But to me, it kind of looks like a turkey. <laughs> I don't know why, it just has that turkey look to it. I don't care that it has no feathers. Um, though it has a couple feathers um, on the top of the head and then on the bottom of the tail. And the feet look very nice. So, it's an okay, but I'm not going to pick it up since I would have preferred it in a different pose. And finally, we have my favourite. The Iguanodon, which Spino Dude mentioned, it resembles the one we see in Jurassic. Uh, no, not Jurassic. Anything? Uh, Disney's dinosaur. One sec. Um, it's got an articulated jaw, though the head doesn't. It's a very detailed model, and I actually really like it. So guys, those are my quick thoughts and opinions. I hope you did enjoy. Believe it or not, this is all of them. Oh, and they've got a set collection. It's called the So yeah, I hope you did enjoy. I don't really hate any of these. Well, I hate most of these. And this is it. I don't believe they're releasing anymore. Because I heard they're not. We are not sure. I don't believe they're going to release it anymore. So, guys, I hope you did enjoy. And.